the trail. We are getting ready to uh, hike down by Cave Run Lake. Uh, we had a great hike last time. Uh, a little tired there at the end from all the road walking, but uh, it was a good hike. And today we get a little bit more scenic stuff. Uh, I cannot wait to see Cave Run Lake. Uh, get some pictures down there and see that. Uh, the trail is really dry today. Uh, there hasn't been a whole lot of rain recently, so hopefully water sources won't be scarce, but it should be a good day on the trail. out here in front of uh, Cave Run Lake. Absolutely beautiful out here. It's just nice to get some scenery this time. I think this is the first time really on the trail where we've gotten a lot of really good views. And uh, it's just beautiful out here. It's wide open, all the rolling hills. Uh, Kentucky's not known for a lot of mountains, but we're definitely known for a lot of rolling hills. It's just absolutely beautiful out here. Can smell the barbecues going and it's just not fair because all I want to do is like go eat everything these people are cooking at their barbecues. You can smell the, the charcoal, you can smell the lighter fluid, it's just like I'm like hiking and I'm salivating right now because it just smells so stinking good. So this hike's a little different than the last one. Uh, the last time we were out here, the weather was beautiful, sunny, just kind of like it is today. Except the last time we were out here, the highs were in the mid 70s. Today it's like 90. So it's a hot one out here today. Definitely sweating a lot already. We're only a couple miles in really. And uh, anticipating it continuing to get hotter as the day goes on. So. We'll be drinking a lot of water. Thankfully, this isn't like the last two stretches we hiked. Uh, there's actually water sources along the way. So uh, we won't be struggling to get our water this time. Taking a little break right now. Uh, the weather's winning right now. So trail's been fantastic. Um, it's looked really nice out here. It's just a beautiful day. Um, I've just got to get my body to calm down a little bit. I actually took a tumble back a little bit ago. There was a there's a, a hole of some kind and I stepped in it. My, my foot turned and uh, just kind of fell sideways when I did. My heart rate jumped obviously. I'm just trying to get it back down. So taking a little bit of break. Just kind of getting ready for all this. It's days like today that uh, you can't undervalue water. Um, we're a few miles in. I've already put down a liter of water and uh, I'm hoping I didn't grossly underestimate how much I need for this hike but uh, definitely have have gone through the water pretty quick um, it's just hot it's just really really hot so uh, just trying to get that blood pressure down that heart rate down and uh, get back get back to hiking again That was 13 miles that became 17. Uh, that was a rough hike for me. Um, the uh, the guide that we were using from the Sheltoe Trace uh, was actually wrong on a lot of miles. And uh, because of that, I didn't have enough water. And I became dehydrated about a few miles into the hike. It was 90 degrees out. I'm a big guy, so I did a lot of sweating. And I got really sick. Uh, luckily, about 11 miles, we hit water finally. 
After we hit the water, uh, I fill up everything. I drank a liter and a half right there. Um, and within about an hour, I started feeling a little bit better. But uh, that was a rough hike today. If you notice, there wasn't a lot of video today. Um, it's just because I, I'm exhausted. And uh, so I'm gonna head out now and I am gonna go see my wife and my kids. And I'm gonna go get some ice cream because dang it, we just hiked in 90 degree weather for 17 miles. So y'all have a good day. Thank you.